In this video, I'm going to show you another utility within Power Toys tool named as Peek. Now, what is Peek? Peek allows you to preview the files without even opening in File Explorer. So that means technically you are getting a preview of the file before you open or execute that file in File Explorer. The exact application uh, will not be loaded, but it will just give you the sneak peek of the application. Now we can configure various settings to close the preview when the focus is lost. The shortcut for this is control space. So let me show you action. If you go to Power Toys, then you go to Peak, it shows you some information about Peak. Peak is a quick and easy way to preview files. You need to select a file in File Explorer and press the shortcut to open the file preview. So turn this on setting and then you press Control Space. Okay. Now the behavior is always run not elevated even when Power Toys is elevated. So based on your uh, computer settings you can either turn it on or off what it says is that it tries to run peak without elevated permissions okay uh, you can turn this on or off and automatically close the peak window after it loses focus so either you can turn it on or off if you turn it off then the preview window will still remain uh, in focus okay and then that you have to close it manually now uh, I'll show you what what does this application actually does now let me go into oh uh, say documents okay so these are the uh, set of documents which i see in the application now if i want to see the preview of say this document okay what is the shortcut now let me go here and say control space is a shortcut so if i press control space watch what happens it is technically opened in application okay, which is a previewer and it displays the content of the document now as this is a pdf document it is showing me the pdf result okay let me go and open the docx so control space is the shortcut and it will generate the preview of that document now here you will see just the first page preview of the word document now in the word document i don't have anything written it's just one line of text and that's why this is what you see let me see if you can get a preview of markdown document yes you see the markdown document preview as well so this is also one of the handy way through which you can see various documents uh, preview so again control space and this is a pptx now you don't see a preview of ppt over here in this particular version Re registry file yes you can see what is there in part of the registry file so again uh, let me see the text file so control space and i can see the text file preview as well okay now now again pdf talk so let me press control space now you know one of the setting which we did is like what we said is like we don't want to manually close it if i just lose the focus then this application will automatically be closed so if i do that this application is closed see the g code file no g code file does not have a preview because this file technically does not have a thumbnail attached to it see the stl lithography file now here yes it has a preview uh, let me check for some images you know now for some images like say this one okay if i press ctrl space i can see the png file uh, preview okay now let me minimize this a bit okay and then come here ctrl space and then this and then here ctrl space and then this uh I ico file now this is one of the icon file if i press ctrl space i can see the preview same here Control space I can see the preview same with tiff oh uh, yes I can see preview of tiff file as well let's see wp that p no I don't see that jff yes I can see the preview and so on and so forth so even for svg it shows a preview so that's it folks this is all about uh, looking into the preview of the file without even opening it
So this is a very useful utility as well when you just don't want to execute the file and then just want to see the preview before even triggering that application uh, to open the file. So, uh, so that's all about Peak. Uh, thanks for watching.